I got Danny Gay here boxing. <laughs> interview, interview, I'd rather do an interview. Please don't break my arm. Okay. <laughs> Rule number one, never give your back. Today I'm with Danny Gay, number 10 in the world for UFC. So tell us a little bit about yourself, Dan. Thank you, John, for having me. My name is Dan Ige. I'm a UFC featherweight. Um, my record is 14-3. I'm from Haleiwa, Hawaii, and I'm currently residing in Las Vegas, Nevada, but I'm here, I'm home for a few days, so I get to hang out with my nephew, John. Uh, I have a couple questions for you, Dan. Okay. Do you like pineapple on pizza? Negative. I don't think pineapple belongs on pizza, <laughs> but I like pineapple and I like pizza. Just not together. Would you rather have candy or healthy food? Um, I don't really like candy. I mean, I, here and there I'll have a few treats, but I like to eat a pretty healthy diet year round because I like to, not that I have to, but I definitely prefer healthy food. So would you rather be a hobbit or an elf? I am a hobbit. Have you seen my feet? <laughs> size 12, five foot six, size 12 feet. So I'm a hobbit. Not by choice. <laughs> <laughs> Bones have you broken? Um, I'm pretty lucky. I haven't broken any bones in my life. I mean, I've had a few, uh, like knuckle fractures and foot fractures, but nothing that requires surgery. I'm pretty fortunate. I think I have pretty dense bones, so, um, no broken bones in my life. Thank God. So, would you rather live in a place? where it rains all the time, or a place that is super hot and humid, but is always sunny? Mm, I definitely, I think I would rather place live in a place where there's sunshine, because you get that, just something about the sunshine, you get the natural vitamin D, and it makes you feel good even if it's humid, so. Would you rather sleep in garbage can or swim in a sewer uh, well that depends do I have to sleep in the garbage can for the rest of my life or is okay. it just a one thing I would probably sleep in the dumpster why why because uh, it's just more comfortable I don't want I don't like sewer water what is the weirdest type of snack or candy you've ever had? Mm. Weirdest snack or candy I've ever had? Uh, it's hard to think of at the top of my head. I, I think Japanese candy is pretty weird. They make some like weird flavor. I think I've had like I don't know. They made some like toothpaste flavored Mentos. <laughs> that was kind of weird. Yeah. Toothpaste flavored. Yeah. And you ate it. Yeah. Why Second you... weirdest thing would probably be the Harry Potter jelly beans. <laughs> what? <laughs> they make like earwax flavor. <laughs> what? How do you get these flavors? Or grass. Grass flavored. <laughs> oh. <laughs> What's the weirdest thing? you've done in school the weirdest thing I've done in school was I had to use the bathroom one time and my teacher wouldn't let me so I used I went to the bathroom in a bottle in class <laughs> no, I couldn't the teacher didn't allow me so that's probably the weirdest thing I've done <laughs> Thank you, Danny Gay, for doing these little questions. Of course. Thanks for having me. You're a legend. Your father's a legend. And hope we get some, some views. <laughs> Perfect. Okay, good.